Mr. Smith. My name is Alan Prose, and I'm here to do a blood gas today, your doctor's ordered blood gas. I've already looked at your chart, and I didn't oh, see I, anything. I, I just had blood done. Did you just have some blood I work had done? Some blood drawn okay, you know, that's a little bit different because that's, they just did the regular blood work just at your elbow there? Yes. Okay, so they got venous blood. This is particularly different because we're going to actually take a little bit of blood just from your wrist, okay, just right here. And, uh, and the reason for that is because we want arterial blood. Okay, we're going to measure the amount of oxygen and carbon dioxide in the acid that's in your blood, and we need to do that from blood directly from your heart, and that's arterial. Okay. Is that okay? Your doctor wants to do that because he wants to assess your oxygenation status. See how well you do on room air. So my, my doctor wants this done? Yes, he does. Okay. Okay? All right. So I'm just going to wash my hands here. All right. I've already looked at your chart. You're just in here. You had a bit of a pneumonia, and you're just recovering from that? Yeah. Okay. I'm just getting, I'm hoping to go home. We'll see if you can, how well you're going to do on the mirror. Okay? I've got everything well, I need right uh, here. I wear oxygen at home. Okay, well, your doctor specifically wanted me to test to see if you could, how well you did on the mirror. Okay, so we're going to remove your oxygen. I'm just going to assess you right now. So my, okay? my doctor's asked for this. Yes, he has. Okay. So I'm going to put this pulse, this is a, a little bit different kind of pulse oximeter. It actually measures your, uh, your end tidal CO2. So your carbon dioxide, you're exhaling, plus your saturations, your respiratory rate, and your heart rate. Okay. So, okay, well, that looks really good. I'm just going to confirm that it's working well here. Just watch the waveform and make sure it's correlating with your pulse. You've had this done lots of times. Mm -hmm. Have you ever had a blood gas done? Yeah. Yeah. You yeah, had one of those yeah. done before? Yeah, those done. Okay. They hurt? Yeah, they do hurt a little bit. Yeah. All right. We are putting a needle in the skin, so you're going to feel some discomfort. Okay, well that looks like that's working quite well. I'm just going to check and make sure what oxygen you're on. So I'll just confirm that. Uh, actually, you know, your order was for three liters per minute, and I noticed that you're actually on two liters per minute. Did somebody change that? I, I don't know. Okay, well, you know what? It might have been uh, There's your so nurse. many people. Yeah. No, I, I just don't know them all. But you know, your saturations look pretty good on, uh, on that two liters per minute. So that will, we'll go with that. And now I'm just going to get you, do you want to, do you want to take your nasal prongs off? Sure. Okay. Now my doctor ordered this. Yes, he did, yeah. To take the oxygen off? Yes, he did. Okay. All right. Okay. Because I wear, I wear it at home. Okay. All right. And we're just going to wait a few minutes and just see how well you do on that room there. Okay? So we're going to wait about 10 or 15 minutes and I'll come back and check you. All right? Okay. All right. So you want me to stay here? Yep. You stay right here. I'm stay here. Okay, well it's been, a, it's been uh, 20 minutes, and I'm back now, and I've noticed that your saturations are down a little bit, all right? But that's okay, we're gonna do the blood gas on that room air, all right? So okay, I'm just gonna get a little towel here. And you're right-handed? Yes. Okay, so I'm gonna actually use your left hand if that's okay with you, okay? All right. So I'm just gonna do a little test now, we call an Allen's test, all right? So what I'm going to do with that Allen's test is I'm going to confirm that you have good circulation in your hands. So I'm just going to apply a little bit of pressure here. Can you make a tight fist for me? All right, good. No, just keep it tight. All right, good. And now open it up for me. Open it up. Okay, it's nicely blanched. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, well, that looks like you've got good circulation to that hand. That's just a little test we do just to see that you've got some good circulation. I'm actually going to perform the blood gas on this arm. Is that okay? Okay. All right. So I've got my stuff here, and I know it's a little intimidating seeing that needle and stuff like that. Yeah, I don't like needles. Yeah, well. nobody does. Well, I'm hoping that uh, this will give us the results we need so that uh, we can get you out of here. All right. And I got some, some two by twos and stuff like that. Now, this procedure does hurt a little bit. And it's okay for you to yell and scream and things like that at me. But if you, I don't want you to pull away, all right? It could be really... Well, it's, it's kind of hard to do sometimes when it hurts. Yeah, I know. Yeah. But I really want you to just, just, just hold tight, and I'll be holding your hand a little bit. And I just want you to bear with me until the procedure's finished, okay? Okay. All right. I'm just going to put on some gloves here. I've got some right over here. Keep everything nice and clean for you. 
When you did it before, was there any complications or anything like that? What do you mean? Did you have any bruising? Or it hurt. I don't see anything. It, it, it just hurt? Yeah, it really hurts. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. Just set up here. I'm just going to put these two-by-twos on your hand there. Can I put my oxygen back on you? No, not yet. Okay. We're going to leave it off right up until the time that uh, we're finished taking the sample, okay? okay? All right? And I notice you seem to be a, a little bit nervous now, a little bit. Your heart rate's come up a little uh, I bit. I don't, I don't like needles. Yeah, I don't blame you, okay? So I'm just going to a little bit of cold alcohol here just to cleanse the site a little bit. Okay, I'm just going to wash it down here a little. Okay. All right. Okay. And I'm just going to palpate your here. I can just feel your pulse. Okay. Now you're just going to feel that little pinprick there for a second, okay? Okay, I'm ready. All right, good. Okay. All right, you're just going to feel that little poke now, okay? Woo! I just don't little, like needles. Yeah, just a... Okay, you okay? All right. Okay, oh, that good. hurts a little bit. Not okay. bad. Yeah, just going to hold a little pressure on there, all right? Okay, good. Oh, well, okay. I'm going to take out that little bit of air in the sample there. All right. Excellent. You okay? How's that yeah, feel? It's, it's a little sore, a little but it's sore? actually not... Well, we got your sample right away. Oh, so. good. Good job. Sometimes they don't. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, that worked out really well. Okay. So I'm just going to hold this pressure now for five minutes. Okay? Oh, five minutes? Five minutes. Oh, yeah. you, you can just put a... No, a no, I'm going to hold it here. Have... Do you want me to hold it? No, I'm going to hold it. But you know what I would like you to do? With your other hand, could you put the uh, put your nasal prongs back on for me? Sure. Can you do that? Okay. Could you put those back on? Yeah, just like that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm holding the pressure. Good. All right, so you got your nasal prongs oh, back that on. That feels so much better. Okay, just keep that pressure on there. Oh, yeah, I noticed once we got that, you know what I'm going to do? It's been about five minutes now, so I'm just going to check the site. Oh, that looks good. All right. That looks good. There's no bleeding or anything like that. Okay. I'm going to get it, and I'm just going to adjust your oxygen to one liter per minute. See if that's good enough for you. Okay. I'm just going to turn you down to one liter per minute. We'll just see if that's enough oxygen for you. Okay, so we'll just take a couple minutes, see how that's working for you. All right. So how does that feel? It's, it's, it's okay. All right. Yeah. Okay. It didn't hurt as much as I thought it would. All right. Yeah, sometimes okay. they really hurt. I think uh, you, You've been doing this for a while? Yeah. Yeah, not bad. Well, you know what? Your sats haven't come up quite as good. Your doctor wants this number to be greater than that 90%. And you're just kind of on that 90%. Okay. So I'm going to put you back up to that two meters per minute. Okay? okay? I think that's somebody had obviously, probably your nurse had already titrated you to that. And I think that seems to be the right number for you. Yeah, somebody moved it earlier. Okay. Now, the order originally was for three liters per minute. But I want you to remember that you're on two liters per minute. Okay? Okay. Is this what I wear at home? Yes, it is. I think that's what we're going to recommend right now. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to have to take all this down to the lab. And, and I can go home now? No. Well, we'll talk to the doctor. He's got to sign your orders and all that kind of stuff before we can go. Okay. Well, I hope I can go home today. Okay. Well, I hope so, too. All right. Well, thank you very much. Right now, I want you to remember that you're on two liters per minute. So if you go to the washroom or anything like that, I want you to take a tank with you and, and uh, take that oxygen with you wherever you're going at two liters per minute. And I'll write it on, on the chart and let the nurse know what you've done. Okay? Thank you. Well, thank you very much. All right. All right. Bye-bye.